So our final race from sunny Perth is the Crabbies Handicap Chase. Race 21 on your big card is over two and a half miles. And all to 140, so Lux are for, Lux are for Darren Thompson, Monica Le Coulier for Martin Leadham, Major Left from Verglass for Alex Cherry, Pride Romano for Tom Rogers, Attractive Branch for Jimmy Shea, the Ranting Aunt for Grey Clutterbuck, make up just seven. So a small field here. Last here at Perth. Start has got him away. And Luxor. I'm not sure what happened. I was a bit reluctant to start. And he's uh, dropped three, four lengths off the back of the pack already and being pushed along now to try and get back into this. So as they get to the first, it's Ranting Aunt that leads us over it. Major left taking a keen hold in the grey Monica who we are up against the fence. And the two green silks of Pride Romano and Attractive Branch, Tom Rogers and James Shea. Pushing through there again is Verglass. And they all take a keen hold there, which is lucky because that's allowed Luxor for Darren Thompson to get back with them all. So uh, they jostle the lead. Nobody really wants to take it on into the big ditch. They'll jump it well. Maybe the worst landing was Major left. They're all pretty close to knit here. Three lengths between first and last. We go through the first half mile and go over the third. Everyone takes that well. No, a couple of them giving reminders already to get there. Get on the job. And it's the Ranting Aunt Burglass. Burglass taking another keen hold as well as Pride Romano and Attractive Branches holding still. So it's this Ranting Aunt for Grey Clutterbuck that's going to lead us down to the next. The fourth to plain one. All over that, a little bit uh, slow over it was major left and just drops back towards the rear. The ranting arm, so race right handed. Go past the grandstand for the first time. So it's the ranting arm, Verglass and Monica looking up against the rail. The Lux or an attractive branch towards the rear is Pride Romano and major left. There's still only five lengths between first and last here. All kept together. The Ranting Arch that's going to lead us over the water, I think. Which is the next. It's not, it's a plain one. And he jumps it well. So the Ranting Arm, by about three to the well held attractive branch. Lux all the top weight on the outside as they go to the seventh. And the furlong left to run. This will be the last next time round. It's the Ranting Arch, the attractive branch, Burglass, Major Left, the Grey Monic, the Uye. Near Luxor, there's the water and Pride Romano. So they all get over that. So we've got a mile and a quarter left to run and another seven fences to take. It's the ranting arm that still leads for Grey Clutterbuck. Leads by about four now, so they take that left hand bend which shuffles the pack. And it's given him a four length advantage from major left and second. One of the is third, but the last is fourth. I assume Attractive Branch and Pride Romano and Lux are all still there as they all go over the ninth. So it's just this rambling arm. Aunt that we ranting aunt that we can see. Then they are from major left and second. Pride Romano, Verglass and Monica Hooley all together. And a length and a half back to Luxor, an attractive branch. So as they come down to the final mile, and it's the ranting, the ranting aunt that still leads. Ranting, it's like Ran, isn't it? Steve Ran, Steve Ran, ranting, rant. Oh, we've lost one. It's Luxor the gone. That's our top weight for Darren Thompson. Unlucky. I'll get back to the race and stop. Waffling and it's the ranting arm that leads us into the 11, takes it well. The rest are all still their feet, but we're in single file now, so it's the ranting arm is first, Major Left, Major Left is second, Pride Romano is third, moving up on the inside is Verglass into the fourth. Monica Lahuvier has got a little bit to do from there, as well as Attractive Branch with just five furlongs left to run. And it's this ranting arm that still leads by a couple of lengths to Major Left and Verglass of Alex Cherry, who are trying to close the gap, moving well on the outside of that is Pride Romano for Tom Rogers, and the two are a little bit disconnected. Now, Monique Lahoulian and Attractive Branch are probably not going to win from there. As we come inside the final half mile, swinging right handed, the Rantin Aunt still leads from Verglass as they start to go uphill. Pride Romano, major left, trying to make a run from it now from the back is Monique Lahoulian, but it's the Rantin Aunt being challenged now by Verglass and Pride Romano on the outside, pushing through well as major left. This poor Rantin Aunt doesn't look like he's got love left as we come down to a quarter mile from home, and it's Verglass, Pride Romano, major left as they go over it. Verglass was slow, major. Major left jumped it best, and Major left is away from Verglass in second. Pride Romano's got nothing left. The 
dancing arm as they go over the last. And the major left and Verglas is the Dalek's Jerry Horses neck and neck fighting him out for, together. And it's major left, Verglas, major left just by half. Major left from Verglas, Verglas is fighting back. Verglas, major left, Verglas by a nose. Major left fights back up again. Major left takes it from Verglas. Third was Pride on one, I think, running on well for fourth is Mike for BBA. So one, two there for Alex Jerry. It's two horses. Fight now, neck and neck. And it goes to major left. Burglass was second for Alex Jerry. Pride Romano for Tom Rogers was third. Monica Julio for Martin Leland was fourth. And the ranting ant for Grey Clutter Bale. Lantern leader was fifth.